Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Tales of Vesperia. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, we had just beaten the big bad boss in this area, uh, where I freaked out on, uh, <laughs> freaked out on, uh, there we go, perfect. And freaked out on <laughs> Carol for saying, oh, that was an easy fight. Where this broadcast very much was not. Better. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Yeah, no. Hey! Level up for repeat. Uh-oh. Apparently we're also... Still poisoned. Uh oh. Oh, Carol is. Okay, well, we'll fix that. Um, we'll go to Estelle with not this. What was I thinking? Uh, it was arts. That's what I have to go to. Uh, recover. Uh, use. Um, there we go. And then first aid will be good for him as well. But. Using up a lot of Estelle's TP in the process. So, let's fix that with a. Eh, let's do Melange Gel. Then it'll also give her health and up too. There we go. Perfect. And then one for me of the Apple Gel. And that should get us pretty good so far. Alright. We were trying to pass through this area after we defeated the big beastie. Uh, right here, and we noticed this beautiful view right here. Absolutely gorgeous. And we need to continue on the way we were going. Although I think there was a way up in the other direction that could lead to something. But I don't know. I didn't try it before I started. So we're going to try it. Oh, wait. It's already been plundered that direction. I see the treasure chest now. Okay, never mind. Away we go. <laughs> Gotta love when uh, my brain is slowly catching up. And then I notice little clues that tell me, oh, yeah, you did the thing, stupid. All right, down we go. Should be... Getting past this way. Oh, and that was not how I hoped. I'm gonna go. make you work. Oh well. There we go. Oh, thank you for the sharpness. Oh, I that. If only I could use it effectively. Could you be any more of a pain? I mean, yeah, but I'm assuming that's not directed at me. Okay. Um. Cooking. Just, just curious what we can do there. Oh! Salisbury steak also requires egg? Didn't know that. Damn it. Alright, well, let's do sandwich. Hey! Health up 10%. Nice. That seems pretty good. Yep, man! There it goes that. Okay. Piece of cake. Just don't get a careless. Lot of combat. In the midst of all this. There we go. Destruction field. There we go. Perfect. Well, that worked out better than I expected. We finished them off. I finished them off. Huh? I mean. That's nice, but I can do so much more. Oh yeah. These are the threads that weave our future. There you go. Now you guys are learning. Good stuff. All right. Beautiful. Now. Mm, 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 we've already learned all of that. And do you really need? No, not really. Do you, you don't really need the physical attack up. You're more of a magical user anyway. It's fine. And the knit cap is worthless. Cloak is worthless. The attack ring. I don't know about that. Oh. 
raises attack by 10% during battle. Uh, is that... I guess that might be worth a little bit. Um... Hmm. Might as well hold on to the poison ward just in case. But I think I'll put the attack ring on Yuri. Probably for the best, considering I control him primarily. Um, hmm. Other than that, um, huh. I don't think there was much else in the way of uh, things I needed to do. Uh, so she's learned the stuff from the stiletto. Stilello does up her magic attack, but mm, it is a significant chunk higher with it as opposed to without. And it's not like the bonuses she's getting from the rapier are any significant upgrades in that regard. So I guess we'll just get rid of the rapier. Um... Tamahagane. That's still something he needs to learn from. That's fine. And the Francisca is still something he needs to learn from that. That's fine. And then we'll... Actually... Well, it depends what weapons fall into our lap from here on out. Huh. What I'd do from here. Uh... Oh! What's this? Hmm. Oh, that's a camping set! Uh, with this, you can set up camp and sleep without having to go to an inn. Oh, that's nice. Now you can go off and play Nature Boy whenever we sleep at an inn. And we'll sleep funny, too. <laughs> what are you talking about? Camping sets are single-use only. Oh. Rhea, don't be so mean. Hmm. Okay. That sounds really useful, Carol. Yeah, yeah. very useful. They're essential when you're on the road. In addition to camping and sets, why have I not you could also sleep on yet? mats. But camping sets are really the best thing to use. You can't get a better night's sleep with anything else. Okay. What wonderful timing. All of you look so exhausted from climbing. You look pretty pooped yourself. Yeah, we've got a ways to go before we get to town, too. Maybe we should set up camp here. All right, I'll get everything set up. Okay. Oh, once you've camped somewhere... You won't be able to camp around there for a while afterwards. Okay. What's that? After camping at a certain site, the basic barrier that's included in the camping set will stop being effective for a while, so long as you're near that site. Basic barrier? What's that? There's no Blastia like that. It's not a Blastia, actually. Okay. It's just something that gives off a smell that monsters find unpleasant. That's why they call it a barrier. Oh. It can keep the monsters at bay for a night. But after enough time passes, the monsters get used to the smell, and it won't keep you safe anymore. Ah. Hmm. That makes sense. Yeah, okay. Well, then, we'll leave the setup to you, Carol. All right. All right. Let's set up a camp a little bit further. Okay. We got a tent. Hell yeah, an all-purpose heavy-duty tent. Restore 75%. Of max HP and TP. Okay. Setting up a camp is very useful. Well. Set up a camp by using a mat, simple tent, tent, or barrier on the field map to recover HP and TP. The amount of HP or TP recovered depends on the item. You will not be able to use an item to set up camp again until after the next battle. Okay. So there are one use only. And I can use them, really, whenever I'm on the field map? World map? Bit of both? I'm not entirely sure. Okay, well, got you. I won't lose! Alright. <laughs> At least these are the small ones. Not the big, angry, boss version. Oh, oh you're, not, you're not doing that. You little shit. Stop it. Okay. Ow. There we go. Alright. 
There we go. Now we're getting some progress. Oh, Caprice, that was easy. Yeah, a little. Not the best I could have done. I feel but power running all through my body. Haha. Ha. Another level up. Oh, yeah. Oh, geez. Okay. Not. We can exactly still overcome this. How I was hoping this would go. HP by the end of the battle, though. Okay. I guess that's a thing. Oh, I feel so powerful! Good. Neat! Okay. Wow, there's a lot of treasure chests over here. Armet Helm! An iron helm covering the entire head, often used as display. But, I mean, hey, if it works, I guess. Alright, um... Let's check that, in fact, uh, actually. That is not insubstantial amounts of defense. Hmm. Okay, and that allows me to give the Iron Soleil to Carol. There we go. Worked out beautifully. There we go. <laughs> Don't get in my way! There we go. Get some good in progress now. Right Alright. <laughs> I got a little worked up. That worked out beautifully. They never even got a single chance to attack. <laughs> no damage taken. Hell yeah. Gotta love it. Alright. Ape Man Coat. Don't know why it's Ape Man Coat. But hey. A holy Bottle. And 2,000 gold. Okay. Alright. Anything else tucked away in here? Nope. Okay. Worth a shot. I guess. Okay. Yep. Hello. <laughs> we got a head start. That it we doesn't did. seem fair. Oh, wow. Destruction field! This I don't know. Destruction field! <laughs> Destruction field. <laughs> oh, flickering blaze. You stop that. <laughs> Destruction field! Pierce Cluster! <laughs> It'll be a hundred years before yeah. you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Yeah, no. Hmm. Okay, sure. We got beef out of that? We got beef out of that fight. Interesting. Okay. And there's nothing in this direction, so I don't even know why I bother trying. But... Does this put this on the other side of the blockage? I guess it does. You know, I think it'd be better if we turned back. How come? This is where that broken Blastia is. I know that. Come on, let's go back. If the Knights find us, we're, <laughs> we'll get into trouble. I just want to have a look at that Blastia. I'm just going to look. You might get caught. I'm not that much of a klutz. Rita! Hey now. Ekaterine. Ah, uh, what? Ekaterine. She named that Blastia, didn't she? She did, didn't she? All set? Yes. There's nothing that I can do for her. It's just too cruel. Really? I mean, I understand that Blastia are very valuable items, but... It's not about how valuable they are. Countless people have given their lives to make human civilization what it is. And Blastia have been living together with mankind all of that time. They're more than just a simple tool that we use. 
well, it's certainly clear that Blastia are very important to Rita. Yes. If you're all finished here, we should be on our way. Okay. All right. That gave us a little bit more into, uh, A, how Rita regards Blastia, B, uh, how she'll name Blastia, <laughs> uh, just randomly from the look of it, and, uh, yeah, understandable, I think, I understand anyway, okay, return to field map. What the what? What the what? What are these things? They're all over the place. Oh, we'll crush them all. They're bandits. <laughs> Little test. Ready to go. Detection. Okay. <laughs> they are just bandits. Okay. I'll blow you away. Yeah. Feel this holy power. Okay. Feel this holy power. Oh! Okay, so... I, I can't take much more. How careless. Okay. So these guys are physical. Okay. Okay. I forget how to change colors. Okay, yeah. these guys are amazing. And that's what's causing the majority of our problems. Ow. There we go. Oof. Oof, fitty. Oof, oof, oof. Alright. Well. Hey, I learned something. Yeah, look at that. You learned something. Okay. Well, that was definitely not what I expected. Okay, um, I definitely have to use an item to bring her back. There's no way I'm not. Okay, there we go. Um, apple gel. There we go. Bring you up. Bring you up too, I guess. And there we go. Okay. Um, wow. Huh. So, bandits on the road is a thing. And they can be a hell of a thing. Especially in combo. I won't lose! Okay. Well, we'll deal with these guys. You guys can go. It'll be fine. There we go. I got a little worked up. Yeah. Could have been worse. Well, that was interesting. I'll tell you what. If bandits on the road is a thing. I won't lose. Okay, monsters and bandits. Ow. Okay, I, I need to remember how to do, uh, how do I change target? I don't remember. Okay. This guy. I didn't think that I would run into a situation where monsters and bandits were teamed up. Okay. Okay, you are not going to keep doing that. You are not allowed to keep doing that. Ow. Okay. There we go. Could have been worse. That was annoying. Yeah, yeah, it was kind of annoying, but it could have been worse, I guess. I just keep getting stronger. Lucky you. And learn magic card. Nice. Okay. Oh, you. 
little bit. I'm gonna make you work. Yep. That is a hell of a combo of hits. I like it. Alright. Okay. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because right. you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. No. Nice. Alright. Um... Okay, well. This is, I'm assuming, our location where we're supposed to be going. Um, hmm. So I am running into a situation where I'm running through a lot of my items in combat because eventually the TP just runs out and no one's able to keep on fighting without replenishing it. <sighs> Which is unfortunate. But... At least it's understandable. Considering how much techniques have saved our butt, um, it makes sense that, you know, using them will just take more, uh, da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. that's the word I'm looking for, take more TP and uh, will reduce everything we have in regards to that. Um, No further effect available. Okay. Oh, I see. So, since I'm already carrying that weapon, I don't need to focus on that. I can just focus on the other stuff. Okay. Fair enough. Makes a little bit more sense. Huh. Okay. Just want to check everyone now, just to make sure... But I'm not accidentally doing something like that with everyone. Available through equipment. Well, there you go. Now you at least have that there, uh, Carol. Okay. Well, since we're here, might as well enter the town and not keep fighting outside of it. Like a nasty storm. Oh no. Man, the weather sure changed in a hurry. Yeah, it did. And the music as well. I'm uh I'm sure it's intentional, but I'm getting a little apprehensive because of the music. Let's find an inn before we get soaked. Probably a good idea. Estelle, what is it? Oh, I... I just thought a harbor town would be more... lively than this. Yeah, this isn't exactly how I imagined it either. Yeah. But it feels like the kind of place that core thief you're looking for would hang out. Dedeki was headed for Torum Harbor. I'm sure the two are pretty similar. No way. It's only Nor Harbor that's scummy like this. Wow, okay. Carol just coming right out and saying it's Nor Harbor that sucks ass, alright. What do you mean? Nor Harbor is... It's I all because of the Empire. To that little brat if you didn't have our money. Whoa. Please, sir. Not that. Please give me back my son. Wait, what? With this awful weather the last few months, we haven't been able to launch the boats. Surely you realize, sir, we can't hope to pay our taxes like this. Um, what? You'd better hurry up and capture that Ribgoro beast then, shouldn't you? That's right. If you sell his horn, you'll never have to worry about taxes again. How many times do we have to tell you? So you have their son Savages. in exchange for 
taxes? Is that the sort of scum you were talking about, Carol? Yeah, the Empire's influence is really strong here. I heard things got even worse with the new magistrate. He's some Imperial big shot who does whatever he wants. Which really? means there's no one to complain to if his henchmen act like that. <sighs> but how can that be? How can it be? It just is. That's enough! You're hurt. You might even get yourself killed this time. But it's our son. If I don't go... Ah! What are you trying to do? Oh, Keep you from sorry about yourself. that. Stupid. I didn't see you there. Yeah. <laughs> he does that a lot. Yuri! My apologies, sir. Let me take care of that. But I... I can't afford this treatment. Don't, Don't you have something else to say? Huh? Jeez, you guys been robbed of your manners along with your money? Uh, I'm sorry. Thank you most kindly. There we go. That's an improvement. But, I mean, I understand why their immediate mm -hmm. thought is, we can't afford this. Because, I mean, if you ain't got money to even pay your taxes, quote-unquote, to get back your fucking son. Yeah, your first thought is gonna be, I can't pay for this. What the fuck am I supposed to do now? Instead of, you know, immediately jumping for thank you. Because, I mean, that ends up being a back burner sort of mentality when you're on survival mode. Boy, do I know it. Carol grinning like a fucking jackass. <laughs> huh? Yuri? And now he realizes that Yuri's gone. Okay. Parted with everyone. Interesting. We're not in business right now because the magistrate gets a percentage by way of taxes. I'm really sorry. Wait, what? There was someone dressed all in black wandering around. He was really suspicious. And to think, he's the executioner hired by the Magistrate. I really don't like the era that we live in. I'm sorry, executioner? That was hired? Welcome, have a look at our wares. I will, but I'm also... Wait, why is this... I just have a hammer symbol by it. It's because I'm making it? Is that why? I guess. Oh. Making pineapple gel just requires an orange gel. Huh. Interesting. Making a lemon gel just requires medical herb. Why is that that it goes that way? Special gel after melange gel and then lottery gel. I don't have enough red blossoms for it. Damn it. Okay. Well, there's that. Um, I already have this, don't I? Yeah, I do. Um, iron circlet, not required. Hard mail, I already have stronger stuff than that. Um, oh, now I can make an attack ring. Okay, cool. Add something at least. Half frame glasses. They make you look a bit smarter, but are definitely a pain to wear in battle. You don't say. I would figure that would be the case. Um, trying to figure out the details, but it won't tell me anything. Okay, well, fair enough. Uh, right, then. Guess I'll go to sell. Nectar, bottle... I haven't really used any of that, like, at all. So, I guess I'll sell, like... Ten? Yeah, that seems like something good. Um... I really haven't been using poison bottles at all, really, so I'll sell them. Actually, no, I won't sell those. What am I thinking? I could easily use more of them, but just I don't tend to do it. Huh. 
sage. I don't want to sell this just in case I need it for something else. But I have a feeling I don't need that, and I don't need that. And then I already got skills from this and this. And the weapon I got is currently technically better. Sell both of these. Sell that. Actually, you know what? No, just in case that cloak is useful for something later on. Um, sell seven of those, just because I don't know what they'd be used for. So far, I haven't found anything. Um, yeah, we'll call that all good. And... Yeah. There we go. Beautiful. Morning Star. That... Yeah, that seems like something that, uh... <laughs> Estelle would be using. Recovery... Recover and Vitality. Hmm. A heavy maul. That definitely seems like, uh... Definitely seems like Carol. Uh, Mighty Charge and Strength 2. Interesting. Kogarashi? Uh... Huh. I want to wait until I have everyone in my party before I start buying stuff like that. Oh, I get another one of these. I could just buy it. Cool. Chain mail. That's better than my current? How? Silk cloak. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Breast guard. Makes sense. Thief's jacket. <laughs> Alrighty. Hmm. Interesting how this is better than my current armor. Which is like proper plate armor. It's made of iron, sure, but I mean. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Taxes are high and the shop is not profitable. Could you please buy more? Oh, wow, it's that bad, huh? Oh, it's that bad. Uh-oh. Well, this isn't good. Let's uh -oh. get this over with. Yeah, let's do this. Destruction ow, ooh, ooh. Ow, ow, ow. I like how you're saying slice. All right, who's next? Okay, okay. Okay, all right. Um... Ow. Okay. Ow, jeez. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay. Running away time. Running away time. Running away time is now. Oh, boy. Ooh. Okay. I'm going to be using pretty much all of my apple gels at this rate. It's fine. It's fine though, cause it... Ow. One strike. Ow. As you're ready. Okay, I mean, let me do a destruction field. Too. Okay. Eric, y'all. Damn, it's not over yet. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know. Jesus, that was a hell of a fight. What the? Tits. Okay, wow. Hey, well, there's Flynn. I'm assuming, because I saw a knight armor-esque sort of thing. Yep, that looks like Flynn. Yuri, are you alright? Hey, bud. How you doing? No, no, Flynn, I'm not okay. Are you? Hey, that's my line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> is it your line though? Considering he saved your ass, Yuri, is it really your line? I don't think so. I've been looking all over for you. Really? That one was mine too. Yeah, that was your <laughs> line. That actually was your line. Okay. 
Well, <laughs> that did that. That was about to get ugly. About? All right. That was very ugly. Whoa. Whoa, um, hold on. Well, what are you doing? What? What? Yuri, I'm happy to see you're finally seeing the world outside the barrier. Okay. Well, the the that doesn't explain what the fuck you're so doing. You'll be a little more happy then. Stop pointing that thing at me. Yeah, a little bit of that. A little well, I got stopping. a little less happy when I saw this. Hey, it's up to ten thousand gold. Nice. <laughs> Not your response to a wanted poster. I mean. I guess it kind of is when you know you're already fucked up. But, I mean, really? <laughs> Yuri, no. I didn't think when you quit the Knights that you'd take up a life of crime. I didn't necessarily intend to. <laughs> face. That fucking face. A lot of things so have happened, Flynn. It's not that simple. Simple yeah. or not, a crime is a crime. Okay. Good to see you're as stubborn as always. I... Uh-oh. What do you mean, uh -oh? Yuri, I heard something happened. Are you all... Yeah, something did happen. Perfect timing. Beautiful timing, actually. Flynn! Huh? The what? Oh, Flynn, are you all right? Have you been hurt? Uh, I I'm fine. Um, Lady Estelis... Oh, I'm sorry. I was just so happy to see you. I... Yeah. I bet, but... Please, this way. What? Uh, but, Flynn, there's something I need to tell you! Um, it doesn't sound like he's willing to listen to I better go find Carol and Rita. Yeah, probably should. Well, they're probably over back where I left them. Maybe? Oh, well, there they are. More or less where I left them. Some guy just dragged Estelle right by us. Are they both inside the inn? Yep. So that other guy was Flynn then. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well... You might not be able to get a word in edgewise if you went in now. Yeah. Seem like they might be in there a while. Want to burn time walking around town a bit? Sure. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Looks like they're still in the middle of something. I don't think we should interrupt. Maybe we should come back later. Yeah, probably we should come back later. Welcome, or so I'd like to be able to say, the Trino Liner Service isn't operating right now. The Magistrate says he'll sink any ship that sets out. Can you believe that? What the fuck? Um... Okay. Uh, messed up. Quite a bit messed up. Also, I'm gonna see if that sage is actually like permanent increase or not. Okay, I guess it's a permanent increase. Fair enough. Now I know. Surveyor's Guild World's Cellar. Hi, I'm a member of the Map Making Guild. My job is to make maps, but I also collect information on synthesizing. I'll let you know when there's new information and check back often. Oh, forgot to introduce myself. Hey, my, my name is Kozakura. We'll be seeing a lot of each other around various towns. Today's suggested synthesis? Today's suggested synthesis? Huh. Sunglasses? Oh. You look tough with these on. Feels just like being a grown up. Okay. Fair enough. Attack ring. I already have one. Scarf plus one. Huh. Great axe. Chain. I already did. Poker. I already did. Okay. Casual ear grabber. Weapon synthesis. A type of item you will most likely be synthesizing often are weapons. This is because there are lots of skills attached to weapons. Old weapons are often needed as raw material for synthesizing new weapons. I suggest you don't discard or sell any weapons that come your way. Thank you for telling me that now. 
On the other hand, old armor is not necessary in synthesizing new armor. It is better to sell old armor first when short on gold. Thank you for telling me that now. Some stronger enemies might drop raw materials needed for synthesization. I think I pronounced that right. Screw it. I don't care. Uh, this type of raw material is likely to yield some good items. For instance, you can create a poison charm with a 50% poison defense from an antibiotic material. Come check back to see if you can use these raw materials to synthesize something special. Okay. I'll let you know when there's new information. Check back often. Can I buy back my things I sold a while back? Oh, okay. Hmm... Okay, well. Alrighty. Hmm. Well. I should buy more. Especially when it'll be useful. Uh, I don't know. I don't want to buy it if I don't end up needing it. Alright. What is this way? It's just like a bridge. It is just a bridge. Okay. Um. Wait, what? Uh. Blimey? What the hell is a brat like you doing trying to get in here? Aw, don't throw a hissy fit. Have a bite of this and calm down. Get that what? out of my face. This isn't the kind of place for kids. Whoa, whoa, okay. Hi there. Mm. That sure is a rough way to treat a child. A little bit. Who the hell are you? That brat's daddy or something? Seriously, uh, do I look like the parent of a kid this big? <laughs> I mean, that's technically true. Time to try again. Time to try again. Oops. Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. You really think it's okay to point a weapon at an unarmed child? Exactly. Like, dude, it's messed up. I'm just teaching the Brad a lesson about the consequences of breaking adult rules. Oh. Just cut it out, okay? That's, that's definitely not a way to do that. And any capacity. Just, mm. yeah. Okay, what the f what? What are you doing? Yeah, good question. <coughs> now you've got and done it. This kid, j this guy's just flailing wildly, <laughs> thinking he'll eventually hit a kid. First off, that's fucked up. Secondly, he's gonna end up hitting his buddy if he keeps flailing like that. Hold up, you, you've come this far and now you're just gonna run away? You need to be prepared if you're going to grab a beautiful young lass's hand. Um, I'm sorry, what? Prepared? Prepared for what? Yeah, prepared sorry. for what? now ain't the time. Uh, what? What? What do you mean by that? Farewell! Okay, bye! You brat! Get back here! Damn it. The hell was up with that kid? Yeah, hey, good question. Buddy, you better get lost, too. All right. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she pulled some fucking ninja shit. <laughs> well, I guess Flynn and Estelle should be done talking by now. One would think. Cast off doll. A doll a mysterious girl left behind in her escape. It's surprisingly detailed. What a waste of talent. <laughs> yeah, sure. A waste of talent, yeah. <laughs> the flying fuck was all of that. What was she trying to do? What the hell? 
kind of character archetype is that? Th th everything, everything about that is just plain weird. You were being chased by a guy with red eyes? Yuri, what did you do this time? What, what do you mean, what did I do this time? Is that guy with a serious look your friend? Hmm, I guess not. What do you mean, guess not? Okay. Alright. Okay. Should we go inside? Yeah, let's do it. Yay, we reunite with the... Three. <laughs> the peanut gallery. Uh... It seems it doesn't matter how much money I have. No ships are leaving, and that's that. I've made my peace with it. Without experiences like this, it's impossible to find out how the common folk live. Traveling as I normally do, I never have the chance at such an important experience. <laughs> Let's just take it easy, eh? Life is short. It should be spent in comfort. I'm not scared of the magistrate. I'm a noble. <laughs> you should be, from the sound of what's going on here in this fucking town. I tell you, this is one mean world. I guess that's not much of a welcome. Anyway, want to stay? It's 300 gold a night. Not particularly... But I'm going to see it's locked. Where I'm assuming that's where they are. Yes, I'm correct. All finished? And are we done whispering secrets? I've heard your story up until this point, Yuri. And also the reason for the bounty on your head. Yeah. First off. I owe you my thanks for protecting her. You're welcome. Oh, I've been meaning to express my gratitude as well, Yuri. Oh, shut up. <laughs> you don't need to express your gratitude. I've been there the whole damn time. It's fine. It's Did nothing. It? Really, I was it was nothing. out searching yeah. for that Blastia thief. Yeah, exactly. And that's where we have a problem. Oh? Hmm? Regardless of the circumstances, the Imperial law cannot allow the obstruction of officers, jailbreaking, and trespassing. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I told him everything. Uh, thank you, Estelle. Now Flynn's gonna do nothing but bust my balls. <laughs> Don't thank be sorry. You. I mean... I did all that stuff. Yeah, technically, yeah, you did. Then I assume you are prepared to receive the punishment your actions deserve. Uh... Um, Flynn! What is the punishment? Do whatever you like, but just listen a minute, will you? Yeah. So you can tell me how it was all done in order to get back the lower quarters Blastia Corps? That's what you wanted to say, right? I mean, technically, yeah. Sir Flynn, I have news! What is Rita doing here? That's a good question. How do you know Rita? I heard you refused an Imperial request for assistance. Are you... smaller than her? Do you think it's alright for a mage employed by the Empire to simply abandon her obligations? Yes. Who's that? Depending on the fucking reason for it. Also, who the fuck is this pipsqueak? Got me. <laughs> <laughs> they know her, but she don't know him. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Whatever. It's not like I care a whit about you either. Aha. Uh -huh. Yet you noticed her face immediately exclaimed, Why did you do this thing? <laughs> and just acted like a pompous little shit. Uh huh. I I'll totally make the introductions. You. This is my second in command, Sodia. Okay. Hello, Sodia. Oh, she cute. This is Witcher, a mage who offered his assistance to us at the laboratory in Ospio. Okay, Witcher. Okay, so this kid's gonna be more obnoxious than Rita. I'm, I can guarantee that. This is my... You! Sir, it's the criminal from the Wanted poster! How are you able to tell? That poster is awful! At ease, uh... Sodia. He is a friend of mine. What? But sir, he's a wanted man! And? I've just heard his story. While he is guilty of minor crimes, the warrant for his arrest contains false accusations. Later, I will return him to the capital and explain the situation. And he will receive his due punishment. Okay. My... my mistake, sir. Witcher, let's have your report. 
Okay. So we're done here, right? I don't think we are. Not I yet. believe the ongoing rain and wind are being caused by a blastia. Oh. The weather in this season is unpredictable, but this does not explain why it worsens whenever boats leave port. Mm hmm. We also have testimony that something like a blastia was carried into Magistrate Rigaud's residence. Uh huh. I've never heard anything about a blastia that controlled the weather. Nothing like that has ever been excavated. Wait. The Aquid Blastia, the ruins. It couldn't be. You think they're connected? So his lordship, the magistrate, is using a Blastia to control the weather. Mm, not just any Blastia. Probably the Blastia stolen from the lower quarter. It appears that way, though we can't yet say for certain. The harbor has been closed due to weather. Any ship that leaves is fired on for disobeying the ordinance. So much for crossing over to Torum. Yeah, so those much aren't for the that. only rumors surrounding the magistrate. He's released a monster known as Ribgaro into the wild and amuses himself by forcing those who can't pay their taxes to hunt it. I'm I'm sorry. I heard about the having to hunt the thing down before. I thought it was just a wild creature that was terrorizing the town in some way shape or form. You're telling me the motherfucker released it just so we could watch people die trying to take care of it? Is that what you're telling me? What the fuck, dude? He claims he'll pardon their taxes if they can manage to capture the beast. How cruel. That is fucked up. That injured couple we met near the entrance must be two of his victims. And More their child. Than not. Oh, Jesus. What? That's right, the child. What happened to their child? Oh, Flynn doesn't even know. Forget about it. What do you mean, forget about well, it? Well, it's been a hell of a day for us, and we're tired. Let's just stay at this inn for the night. Yuri, come also, on, dude. we can't forget about a certain missing person. Missing person? Certain missing person, huh? locked uh, okay well that is what that is okay we got a save spot here okay I'm gonna save then okay so we have the save spot here I'm going to save in just a little bit but uh, also I wanted to make sure that I understood everything <laughs> so I'm taking a second all right okay Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to understand how fucked up this particular town is with the Magistrate. Trying to make a battle royale sort of situation over a creature he released... To have people hunt it down and try and capture it and probably die in the process for taxes that he increased on them. And that is... Whoop. I guess there's a thing here. So, I guess I'll watch that in a second. Uh, yeah, but... I threw off my train of thought. Town's fucked is what I'm trying to say. And uh, we're going to have to probably unfuck it before we leave. For you.